Hey guys, welcome back to Mark's Wheels and Wings. Some more wings for you today. My, today we're going to take a look at my main project now, a uh, home-built airplane here at my house in uh, Chandler, Arizona. This probably looks like a lot of chaos, but I know exactly where everything is. This is my fuselage that I've been building since March of 2020. Thanks to COVID, I had a lot of time off in order to go and uh, get really fabricating this fuselage out of a 4130 tubular steel. Since I started building, I have built rudder pedals, uh, this fuselage so far, as well as I'm currently working on uh, landing gear. And it's all been built from scratch uh, via plans that I got from a company called Steen Aero. This is a Steen Skybolt. Some of the plans for the Steen Skybolt. You can see it's a biplane, two person airplane, capable of aerobatics. And that's been my major source of building product. Some people will say, wow, that looks like a whole lot. I could never do that way too complicated but really it takes time and concentration attention to detail I started this project with having basically a rudimentary understanding of uh, fabrication uh, metal fabrication as well as uh, wood carpentry and such and I've just uh, been learning along the way and consulting with experts that I've found around my uh, community to help me and uh, inspect the work that I'm doing. Today I'm working on landing gear. I have both my landing gear legs uh, fabricated. And what I'm doing today is I'm gonna work on my lathe. I'm turning down some axle wheel collars. I get the entire axle fabricated and I'm able to space the wheels exactly where I need to. And then that way I can come back on this side and I don't know exactly where to mount the brake mount. result of all that lathe turning today. A couple of collars fit right down over the axle. So be sure to stay tuned for more build videos. I'll be detailing the fuselage and rudder pedals and landing gear in future videos. 
Stick around.